everyone, it's Renee. Welcome to this video. Today, we're going to be uh, doing some refashion on this necklace. Now, to begin with, I bought this necklace like a long, long time ago, either at Forever 21, Target, I don't remember. I ended up never using it because I don't really know the color, maybe. I like the pattern of it. So just in case you have something similar, you may find this helpful. So to refashion this, I'm just going to be using a couple of pliers. I'm going to be using nail polishes actually for this. Blackout by Sally Hansen. Again, by Sally Hansen, I'm going to be using a matte top coat. The first thing that I'm going to be doing is separating well the necklace part from the bead part, kind of like separating the chain from the design that I'm going to be working on and for that I'm going to be using my pliers to just open my loop. Once it's done it's easier for me to just start painting it and then pretty much just start working you know painting the whole thing as you go it's not like fully painted if you notice at the beginning there are some parts that are not like fully covered and I like that this step is pretty much up to you and what you like and once that's right simply I'm just going to well add a top coat in this case as I mentioned before I'm going to be using my uh, matte top coat because I wanted my necklace to have a not so shiny in your face uh, finish I just wanted it to have a matte finish so once it's done and dry, I made super sure it was like super dry, like I left it like 24 hours drying because after all I'm just going to wear this necklace so I just don't want to smell like a nail polish. But then I'm just going to put my shame back on and that's pretty much it. I just loved the new look that this one has. Again, I didn't paint the whole thing, I just left some parts like uncovered and I like it because it gives like a... You know, vintage finish to it, that's what I wanted to go for. But yeah, this is the easiest uh, DIY that I've probably ever done. I probably didn't even need a tutorial for this one, but I just wanted to share this idea just in case you have something similar to this. So if you like this idea or if it was helpful for you or just you found it entertaining or something, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up and share it. Thank you so much for watching, I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys!